Good afternoon, Chip here with Hybrid Electric Car Sales, coming to you from my shop. Um, doing another transmission rebuild, uh, Ford Fusion Hybrid over here. Uh, this is a local car from about two hours away in Tennessee, uh, but I got the transmission apart here, and I want to show you what failed in this one. This car was not running when it came. It was, this one was towed in. The transmission was locked up, and let me show you what happens uh, when these lock up. This is after you ignore all the noises that I post about. This is when you ignore the milling noise, and this is when the transmission actually stops. So hold on. Let me flip the camera right. around here. So here is the drive side of the transmission, the EV side. I'm sorry, and this is the bearing that failed, you see all that wankiness? So what happens is, is when that bearing completely wears out and fails, it allows that uh, stator to move around in there. And what eventually happens is, is it breaks off the oil nipple. So that's a broken off. This is what it's supposed to look like. This is from the uh, upper stator and it breaks that oil nipple off. And that oil nipple is what allows this bearing to be lubricated. So it starts self-destructing. That nipple is actually down in, in there. You can kind of see it in that. We'll pull it out. Um, but what happens is, is this, the magnet grinds into the windings and it comes to a halt. So the car does not, let me focus there. The car doesn't, uh, it doesn't move. It doesn't run. You get the, the red wrench and all of that. So we are going to replace the stator. Here's the new stator. Uh, this is, we get these from Poland. Um, it's the only place I can find them that will sell me just an individual stator. It takes about three weeks to get them. Uh, so this client's been waiting patiently. Um, we're going to replace the case cover. we got a new, brand new Ford case cover there and then all the internals. The rest of this didn't look too bad. you got the typical bearing wear uh, on the, uh, the differential here. Man, I can never get good light on this stuff, but there you go. So you can see it there and you can see how they're just chewed up. And then the bearing cup and all of that. So all this gets replaced. Uh, that stays. We'll clean off this. The magnet had a lot of metal on it. Uh, we got a lot of metal out of this transmission. So stay tuned. I'll get it all together. I'll show you uh, what that bearing looks like once I press it. All right, got a little bit more of it apart. And so let me show you uh, what the stator looks like when it's pulled out. So this is all burned up because it seized itself to the inside of the windings. You see all that mess in there? So these grind into each other, and now this is no good. I can't reuse this. In the past, we've tried, but this one's really bad. It had some serious electricity going through there. And then you can see here, the bearing is just collapsed. So new stator, gonna go in. I got on my jig here, and uh, we'll continue working on it.